Okay, so this is what happened. I was playing Call of Duty 4 online, when all of a sudden my PS3 froze, and I got the yellow light of death. So as you see, there's my PlayStation 3, and when you try to turn it on, it looks normal with the red light that always shows that it's starting. But then when you try to turn on, the light turns yellow and starts flashing red. So, the, my, one of my only options is to call Sony and send it in for two to three weeks. And if it's out of warranty, even by a few, even by a month, I'll have to pay $150 for this. And the worst part is I can't get my Call of Duty 4 out of this game, out of this thing. So my Call of Duty 4 is stuck in there, and my $600 PlayStation 3. Doesn't even turn on, just because some hardware failure. And now I gotta send it in to Sony, or I have to buy a new one, so. I don't know, man. Game stuck in there and everything. And this only happens, this is like only, I've heard it only happens in the 60 gigabyte, which is the one I have. So, yeah, this sucks, man. So my, I bought it on January 3rd, and in about a year and a little bit after that, year and a few months, my $600 PlayStation broke. So I don't know. Tell me, send, leave a comment or a video response if I should send it into Sony or if I should just buy the one. All right, peace out.